All right. We got some iron, we got some aluminum, a little bit of carbon scattered about. Not seeing a great carbon spot for scavenger though. Let's see, we can make scientific work up here. We can, we can try going expansive and losing a game, right? It's always an option. It's a lot of iron, but it's very awkward much of it. Oh, we could go down here. This is, this is actually super tempting. Maybe even for a lot of debt, just getting started right in this area. Could be a strong move. Everything's fairly close by and usable. The aluminum's down here, which is the frustrating bit, but you really want that nice mix if you can find it, but I'm not seeing it on this map. Alright, yep, somebody else went for that exact spot that we were thinking about just a little bit before we did. Gotta get a little bit faster at pulling that trigger when we see a really good spot available. I'm tempted just to kind of go sci uh, expansive in this area and see if I can make that work. Not in here. This would be nice, but I'm just so cramped. So maybe I can do it in here and make this happen. I'm going to grab up this aluminum next to me. I thought the iron... I don't know why I threw down over here. I thought the iron was closer for some reason, or I thought I had access to closer iron. That was a bit of a misstep. I was just thinking about the silicon and the water. It's going to take us a little while to go ahead and get started at this point, unfortunately. But with any luck, we'll be in a decent spot. It's just a little bit of an awkward found. What's he upset about? Oh, Niven took the water. That's funny. Oh, come on. That's so frustrating. All right, now we just killed ourselves because I thought the iron was closer. Maybe we don't establish iron. Maybe we try and work without iron for a while. I don't know. It could work. It's a little bit awkward if we try it, but... Man, and this robot threw down in all this water. This is what I get for founding when I did. I should have just taken this strong scientific spot and gone with it earlier. I tried to do something silly, and it's going to kill me. Grab up the steel we need. There we go. Scientific colony expanded. Oh man. Well, we'll see what happens. If I had gotten the iron secured up here, I might have been an okay spot, but no, I've put myself... I've put myself in a rather bad spot at the moment. I don't even know what's happening here. Why is this geotherm going for so cheap? It's still a geotherm. Geotherms are pretty good. I should have just skipped iron this game, it feels like. Fine, whatever. This is what I get. I was hoping to move into additional aluminum kind of down here and take this water. Take this silicon. I guess I can still take this water. I can still move into some extra aluminum. All that kind of stuff can happen. It just might end up being a little bit awkward. And our scientific friend is already in food. So he's just off to a tearing start. Oh, you stay out. Okay, he's going right there. That's fine. That's okay. He can go right there. Not going to be too upset about that. All right. Iron's coming in. Finally. Too late. I shouldn't have done this. No, he's going to take the silicon that I want because he beat me to the upgrade. No, give me the silicon. Get out of here. I think I might skip steel again. It looks like a skip steel game. Unfortunately. That's just kind of what it looks like. Well, so we'll do that. See what we can do with it. I would love to get to a claim. It's never going to happen, though. They're already up at 5,000. I'm just so far behind when it comes to that. Iron, come on, you can do it. We're just getting into the iron too late, unfortunately. Reactors are an option, glass is an option. I'm actually really tempted by the glass option, but I could also just go straight into aluminum for the moment because for whatever reason, these guys have driven that price absolutely insane. Which means we're gonna have to buy into glass very quickly so it doesn't completely kill us, but it gives us kind of a long-term play at least. That's right, no steel, gonna make it work. Even though we took the iron, we're going to go no steel and see what happens. Unfortunately, with this uh, mutiny down right here, it's kind of making everything a little bit weird in this area when it comes to aluminum. Do we keep buying glass? I think we need to go ahead and get into steel before long. We'll watch that steel price. For now, we'll just keep selling everything. We might transition even out of aluminum and into glass production at some point. We got a lot off the aluminum. Oh, wow. That price just jumped back up. Interesting. Interesting. All right. Steel's coming down. Oh, didn't want to sell all of it. Let's 
buy up some steel because it's coming down. See if we can push to an upgrade with just what we've got. All right, there we go. What do I need again? Yeah, 160. That's what I thought. Okay. Well, we're getting there. We're kind of starting to recover-ish a little bit from this the start of this game. I'd love to get into some reactors and some glass furnaces, if at all possible. So we can upgrade. I guess we'll do that. Go ahead and get reactors down up here. We're going to four reactors. I like reactors. They're pretty strong. There are, are already plenty of reactors down for our scientific player, but pirates are available. We'll have to see if we can make that work for us. This iron really should be power. So I'm going to go ahead and start that transition. Nah, I shouldn't have done that. On the other hand, it's not like it's worth anything anyways. We'll keep bidding on those. We need power is the issue right now. We don't need iron, particularly. Iron's just not looking so hot. So we're going to try and make that move into some power. And see if we can make that work. Come on, 24,000 pirates. Are we going to let me have these for 24,000? Shoot. Thank you. Uh, I put that in a position where I'll accidentally take too much carbon. That was stupid. I should have paid more attention. Alright, well I got some food, so that's good. Did I only get 20? Oh yeah, he sent them all right away, so I didn't get as much as I would hope for. And I'm going to be taking away too much carbon for that. Yeah, you can tell. I'm a little bit rusty right now, guys. Don't know. Oh, actually, carbon's up at $62. I'm whining about something, and it ended up being okay. Well, I'll take it. Why am I such an idiot today? Oh, that's just silly. Got one claim left. We just purchased it. So what do we do? We're in reactors, which is good. Let's go ahead and get this power grabbed up. I can't believe I took this tile instead of this tile. I can believe it with how this game has been going, but it's still really frustrating. Silicon's going quite nicely. Maybe we just establish a little extra silicon right now while people try and move into more solar panels and we'll be all right. Water is also pretty terrifying at the moment. So, wow, this carbon price, I tell you. It's nuts. Look at our stock price, though. How ridiculous is it that we've let it get to that point? Oh, man. Well, let's start fixing that problem. I think we're making enough money at the moment we can get away with that, but we're going to want to push to some more claims before long. We established the silicon. Let's go ahead and get into the glass I was talking about doing. Still going no steel, which is a little risky because steel's, steel's getting up there at this point. We can't get to an expansion anytime soon, so we might need to grab a new claim in order to expand into a bit of extra water production. There we go. Just for the time being. These reactors still doing okay. Not as well as we were hoping, because everybody drove up the price on water really hard. So we'll just see what happens. Buy up another stock. We are paying down some debt at this point. Not as much as we'd like. The reactors, yeah, starting to lose it a little bit. But the glass is online, and the glass on being online is a very good thing. We could move back into steel quite easily, actually, if we wanted to. The pirates are done, that's fine, we got a lot out of them. Yeah, I'm thinking the steel move might be the right call here. This guy's already in steel, but man, steel's expensive. Let's go ahead and make it happen. I'll just have to be ready to move around again when we can. Sell, 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 sell. There we go. Go ahead and buy up a little aluminum, just enough for the upgrade. 240 should be it. Yep. That's just fine. Bradbury being terrifying up in this corner. Been ignoring him all game. Herbert's also halfway to the buy right here. Likely just off of steel production. Excuse me. Gonna move back into iron at this point. We'll bid on the claim. Sure, why not? And we'll buy up some stock in ourselves. Just make it a little bit harder to kill us. Come on, guys. Bid on the claim. Bid on the claim. No? No bid on the claim? Alright. I'll take a 9,000 claim. Sure, why not? Let's grab some water. Maybe some more water? Maybe not some more water. A lot of people are out of water at the moment. Maybe what I want to do is just get to an engineering lab right now. And then on the upgrade, plan on doing something like getting into chems. So we got steel coming in. Decently. We have no power online, but power's not that bad right now, so I think I'm okay with it. Silicon's doing all right. We can always transition these over to power if we need to, the same way we did with iron, but much better because they're much closer. And what else do we want to do? I don't know why I'm selling steel when I'm actually, I should desperately be pushing for an upgrade right now. We'll grab that last little bit of stock of ourselves because our stock price is awful. 
And that's why we need to push to an upgrade, so we can increase our stock value easily. All right, getting there, getting there, getting there. Very, very close at this point. There we are. That raises our stock price a fair amount from that upgrade, which is what we were going for. Let's go ahead and see if we can get started on upgrading chem production. And then we actually need to get some chems down. All right, the steel's all kind of okay still. A lot of stock buying and selling going on over there. Whatever. To each their own, I suppose. And let's see. Let's go ahead and get back out of steel, I think, and back into these reactors, if at all possible. There we go. Sell down more glass. Chems again. Thank you. And I'm tempted to go with just another engineering lab with this last little claim here. See if I can make that work. I never really checked off-worlds this game. Aluminum is an option, and actually a pretty good one, but I'd have to scrap my glass for it, and there's just so many ways to make money right now. Chems might not have been the right call, but I'm I'm still more or less okay with it, because there are engineering labs down, we wanted an engineering lab down ourselves, hopefully it'll work out alright. We're also kind of just hiding in our corner, hoping people sort of ignore us for the time being. And that's working so far, but it won't stay, it won't stay that way forever. Let's get that lab down. I'm gonna go ahead and goon that one. All right, what do we want to upgrade? Let's upgrade fuel production, because it's cheap. Steel would still be lovely to be making right now, but... So is everything else on the map, basically. No! Our reactors, they're actually, they're super good, so that's a reasonable play to have made. But still, kind of frustrating. Let's start buying into Asimov a bit, raises our stock price a bit. We can also just buy into Niven, who is in Asimov. Just make a few stock buys here and there to keep our stock price afloat. Power's getting a little iffy, so let's go ahead and get some of that down. Come on, 4,000 for a claim. Let me have it. There it is. I don't understand. I don't understand, but whatever. Glass is moving from the iffy range to kind of bad territory. Unfortunately, well, I could get food down. I could also just establish a little extra water and then get food down. That way I have plenty of water available if I absolutely need it. Let's buy into Niven a bit. Let's go ahead and make this transition now. Especially because we moved out of silicon. We don't want us, it to cost us too much silicon right now. Could buff up power production? It's looking a little bit iffy right now, so it might be the right call. And I need to start paying down debt quite badly. These guys have a lot of cash on hand. I was trying to do some stock buying to kind of support myself, but I've ended up in a bit of an awkward spot, all told. So let's see if we can make this happen instead. All right, that's all going just fine. This dust storm is not going to help out significant amounts of my production for the time being. I may have let debt get to government levels, says Asimov. Yeah, he's sitting up at 250,000 debt. That is quite a bit. I'll hand him that. That is quite a lot of debt. Man, we are nowhere near covering our power costs right now. That's insane. We have this geotherm over here that I've actually let sit here all game. How awful am I? I don't even want to think about that and how bad that is. Dust storm, please go away so we can survive. Please go away, dust storm. The chems are still doing all right. Like, we're making money and nobody's getting in our way of killing Niven. We just need the cash on hand to do it. Oh, Niven actually gets a buy done, though. That's awkward for us. On the other hand, our stock price is doing well. But his stock price is also doing very well right now. Okay, finally. Our food comes back online with the dust storms going away. Power production is doing a bit better at the moment. And Herbert's in my way. I was really just trying to keep my stock price afloat. Okay, Herbert, get out of here. Exactly. You just get out of here with your nonsense. Interesting that Saberman is the first one out of this game. Electronics are starting to look very nice in a lot of ways. Oh, Power, please come online and start paying my debt. Please, 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 please. Everything's making cash, guys. This not so much anymore. We could m make a move out of here and on into electronics, and I think that's all right. Should be fine. Aluminum is a bit expensive for this. I don't know exactly how much the electronics will make. Uh, no, electronics actually not so good. Instead, let's go ahead and just do something super dumb and be like aluminum, aluminum, and then what? Food, food, power, power, maybe? Not power, power. Power, power would be silly. What do we do, though, with these last two tiles? There's just two random tiles here. we got to figure out something to do with them. Steel's not good. Seriously? Seriously, again? Right now? All right, uh, let's see. Not these. 
Is there some food being sent? There is some food being sent. Alright, then we'll go right there. Don't know exactly what that's going to take. Hopefully it'll be enough. We need 98,000 to actually finish off Niven at this point. I really got to figure these out right here. I have no idea. Fine, farms. Just farms. Just go with it. Kims, you've got to be starting to move toward the awful range. All right, let's beef up electronics production so we can actually move into it now that the aluminum price has changed up significantly. That's not doing as well as I was hoping it would. So let's just actually move into the electronics now since aluminum came way down. Steel also way down. I'm really hoping we can make this buy happen. <laughs> don't be talking about me, Saber. Come on. I'm trying to play a game here. We don't need any of that. We don't need any help from the audience right now. Don't need any help from the audience at all right now. Come on. Don't gotta be that way. Come on, 93,000 is all we gotta push for to clean this one up. It's gonna keep going up a little bit as he pays off debt, I imagine. But I'm hoping we can go ahead and make the push. There it is. And I think we've got the game. I think we've got the game. I'm just saying. We're going to go ahead and buff up some iron production because it's looking pretty nice. All these things need carbon. So I'm tempted by a patent lab if I can find a spot to put one down. What is this going on right here? What is this happening? Not a patent lab. Come on. Get down for me. We can build some off-worlds at this point, which is probably going to be a good call. Uh, yeah, off-worlds are definitely a good call. Let's get this repaired. These are actually okay. Uh-huh. This is less okay. Whatever. I'm going to go ahead and grab up an extra claim so I can put an off-world where I actually want to. Let's get it down there. Carbon's coming in a bit. Where is your carbon, man? Right up here? Up next to this Kim's, which should not be happening. Sheesh, I don't even know what's going on there. We can get more carbon down, potentially. We can also just put electronics up there. I'm tempted to go for the carbon for the time being, and then, honestly, I'm gonna leave the other two claims there. And I'm thinking about going slant drilling, just so I don't have to figure out all of these variety of problems that I have. Let's get a couple more stocks bought up. All we gotta do, I think, is push for Herbert. Got the off-world going up. The patent lab, what were we gonna do? Carbon scrubbing's taken, nanotech's taken. Let's go for thinking machines. We'll need a goon squad before too terribly long. We could upgrade, but steel's a bit on the expensive side. And when I say a bit, I mean exceptionally expensive right now. So I don't really want to do that. Let's upgrade electronics a bit more. And then maybe we'll upgrade some steel and get into that production before long. Alright, I can't believe we survived. Based on how we started this game. That was... That was a dumb start. Let's get this goon squad down before anybody blows that up. Man, food and oxygen both are incredible. How ridiculous is that? So, let's go ahead and we've got electronics upgrading. We could upgrade. We could upgrade. Steel's coming down a bit. We could just throw down another off-world. Why not? These chems. How much money have I been burning on these the whole time? I'm complaining about the other guy having chems down in his corner, and I'm sitting here going, uh, yeah. Whatever. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I don't even know, guys. I'm going to take an upgrade just so I have a few more claims to work with. We're going to go Geotherm there. And I think that's the last Geotherm spot available, actually. Five more claims remaining. We could go into some more silicon. Look at all the silicon potential we have right here. That's crazy. Or we could just go into a ridiculous amount of steel production, which I'm thinking is quite tempting. There. We're just going to connect our bases. How does that sound? There we go. Now they can trade resources with each other easily, because that's totally not how it worked already, right? Slant drilling sounds good. I'm gonna go for it. Steel's looking so nice. Let's go ahead and get that. No, not not oxygen. Hold on. Send food. I'm not gonna auto send this game like ever, so nobody nobody even begin talking about that because it's just not gonna happen. This guy right here. We'll go ahead and regoon this. Should be worth. Thinking machines almost here. It's getting here slowly but surely. And I'm gonna go ahead and just silicon's good. Right? But we have a lot of silicon down. I guess what I could do is scrap scrap. Silicon, silicon. No, why? I needed that. That was important. She, you guys are so rude. Okay. Let's upgrade some steel a bit more. Uh -huh. Let's see. This power really doesn't need to be. So we're just going to go off world, off world, off world. And over here, the silicon is nice, but I'm tempted to just go ahead and go... Uh, engineering labs. <laughs> 
We're not surprised. Just disappointed. Surprised. Just disappointed. In I'm gonna go ahead and grab a goon squad because I can. Or sorry, not a goon squad, an EMP. I should grab a goon squad, but I'm not going to because I'm bad at this game. All right, let's get out of Kim's. Nah, Kim's were actually good. I should have just turned those on. I was going to move into a uh, glass, but I'll do that instead of electronics up here. There we go. Turn that back on. Glass here. I can't make too many of these mistakes, or I will actually go ahead and just straight up lose this game. Steel, how are you doing? Mm, reasonably. Repair that. Thank you. Go ahead and let's just get another couple food sends queued up while we can. Uh, queue up an oxygen send. Sure, why not? Should be fine. Herbert got to a buy, which is a bit of a concern considering we've just been sitting on our corner not making money. Turn all of these off. Wow. All right. I see how it is. Reactor time. EMP hit. Thinking machines should help. Upgrade some chem production. Upgrade food production. There we go. Most of that should be going already. Bradbury we're going to try and go ahead and get into. He was a bit scary at one point this game. I don't really know what happened to that. And what? Glass is fine. Food is fine. Can Turn on! Stupid building. Repair that. All the off-worlds seem to be working that are online. Let's go ahead and make sure. Send... Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. We just queued up all the oxygen. Whatever. It's fine. Not going to worry about it. I was talking about getting into some reactors. Oh, I did. Let's not talk about that. Let's, let's not talk about that. Oh, there are reactors down. Shoot, I wonder how that happened. The carbon up here does not need to be carbon. Instead, I'm feeling some chem production. Should be strong. We've got a buy on Her Bradbury. Let's take it. Herbert's still a concern, but now that we're down to just one opponent, we really shouldn't be in that much trouble. Oh, he actually regooned that. Shoot. Where are the rest of your off-worlds, man? Let's go ahead and grab a mutiny for those. Repair this guy. With only one player left in the game, we can get away with our stupid off-world positioning, I'm thinking. Also, he's got all these wind turbines down that are doing literally nothing. And patent lab. Uh, what do we do here? Virtual reality? Cold fusion? Could do cold fusion. Could be funny. Da -da -da -da. Teleportation. Let's just do it. I don't even care. Got teleportation secured. We're going for about a hundred... Sorry, about a million dollars is what we're going to need. Or so, after he pays off debt. We've got more on hand than he does. He's going to need much closer to two million than what we need. Could go ahead and throw down a few more off-worlds. Probably not the worst idea. I'd need to find the claims to do it. Let's upgrade glass. Let's upgrade oxygen. That should all be fine. We'll upgrade power and water also. There we go. Now we'll just sell down all the cams we're making. 27 a second right now, just want to point out. And let's see. Herbert is not scientific, so this should be absolutely... Uh, come on. No, those are mine. Where are yours? Come on. Where are yours? There they are. Give me that. Give me that. Thank you. All right, let's cancel a couple of these and instead launch... There we go. Food. 840,000 is what we're sitting on. We need to push to, once again, about a million still. Not a big deal. Could move into some electronics production. The food's not doing as hot anymore, but it's pretty much getting the job done. And that's going to be GG. Woo! That was a, that was a bit of a, a bit of a tense one there for us. Yezo might have a point that we shouldn't have won that one, but we were punished early on for our ridiculous amount of debt. It's just we kind of punished ourselves because what we did was we noticed, okay, I'm getting a ridiculous amount of debt to try and make this game work, right? Based on my kind of poor choice in founding and the fact that my iron got canceled when I was sending it out there. So the, the punishment was we bought our own stock. That was the punishment. Right? That was the issue for us. It was we had to buy our own stock. But we made that work. Now, we shouldn't have gotten to the buy on Herbert, I think it was, that we bought, right? No, it wasn't Herbert, sorry. Who do we buy early? We bought Niven here, early. Right? That shouldn't have been as easy as it was. It shouldn't have been as easy as it was. But I think Niven... 
may have made a bit of a mistake in going for Asimov as hard as he did, things like that, and nobody wanted to kind of commit and build up to that level of resources that were necessary to kill us because we had bought all of our own stock. So it's a bit awkward. Hey, you don't always need steel. That's the best part. <laughs> Defending is not pointless. That's actually a really, really bad mindset that the community has gotten. Defending is not pointless. It's not as valuable as it used to be. But given your options of pay some money to slow that guy down and then get a little more back in the future or don't do that and let him auto win the game you do have a better option there and people should take it more just throwing it out there especially if one of the ways you can defend somebody frankly is to get aggressive on the pur person purchasing them so you can set yourself up to be in a better spot why do you think we picked Asimov to take down? He had the highest stock price by far when we needed to finish him off, but it was still easy to do because we had bought seven of them in the first place. That was the whole point. We were at that point. When we were buying into Niven, we were protecting Asimov. Right? Because Niven needed to turn around and buy his own stock. That was a way of protecting Asimov that game when Niven was close to a buy. But because Niven made the decision to go all out for the purchase, we were the ones who came out on top. It's not that difficult. No, 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 It is defending you, Saberman. You gotta think about it that way. If we're giving Niven a good incentive not to commit money to kill you, that is defending you. We're just doing it in the best way possible by combination saying that if you kill Asimov, you die, and saying if you kill Asimov, we win. We're saying both of those things instead of just one. It is still defending. It's just defending in the only way possible in this game. All right. I hit city five times with sabotage. That's funny. Let's get into the next one. Gonna make it six again. 